What is up, everybody? We are live with KOTOR now. <laughs> Had it uh, blacked out for some reason. Oh, hey, nope. There we go. Now we are. <laughs> Sweet. There we are. Perfect. Right. Well, thank you all for joining us tonight. We are going to be continuing KOTOR for our eighth, eighth part. part, where we're going to be getting off of Kashyyyk. Or Kashyyyk yeah, or whatever. Let's get off this rock. Part three. Knights of the Old Republic. Part eight. Yep. Let's do Talking it. Talking XP. Let's part play. Part 15. Something like that. 16. It's 16, I think. I think I just killed these ones. 18. Right? 17. No, it was part 17. That's what it is. Because it was two thieves. No. No, we've got two Hades in there as well. So it's really part 18. I think. Nice. Cool. All right. Well, um, so uh, let's go kill some slavers, I guess. Right? That's what we're doing. I don't even remember where I'm going. You you just finished getting the Starforge map. Um, right. You I killed got... some of the Mandalorians that were here in the lower Shadowlands. Right. And, and I need to go now... back to Freyr. That's what it yes. is. Yes. We're okay. we're heading to yeah to Freyr, and then we're heading back up to the very top. <gasps> Who's that? Oh, right. That's the other guy. Can I talk to that guy? I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna talk to him just yet. Actually, you might as well. Cause well, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit him on the way back. I just have to go this way to get to I think, Freyr. I think. Pretty sure. I think right? we already talked to him. I think he's at the entrance. Oh. There he is. Well, hello there. I greet you again, Spoof. I am humble, hoping you have found the blade of Baka's sword. Imagine, Chieftain Freyr. Please tell me, have you made progress? Having the blade will gain me valuable support. I found the blade of Baka's sword. You have? Please let me see it. I must be sure. Wait a minute. What's in it for me? Now, let's say here. You can have it. It, it is! It may not look like much, but it is very important relic of my people. Tradition dictates that it be respected. I didn't think I was worthy to search for it, but I realized that was selfish despair. I should have challenged Chundar long ago. I will make amends now. I have new hope. You have led me to this. Perhaps that is what the great beast wanted. We should proceed carefully. I will climb to the surface as quickly as possible and try to gather support. Oh, hey, thanks hey. for subscribing again, Steven. Thank you. Um, when you arrive, we will confront Chundar in the throne room. My people will no longer be slaves. I just love that it goes. Oh, yeah, the official Sith it. business is yeah. great. It's great. All right, time to follow him out. And now we're gonna go talk to Classic. Classic. Rah, rah. Of course. What a good name. <laughs> Such a funny name. Like the developers <laughs> were like, who's this guy? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a good one. You return. Have you found them? Did you kill them all? They were animals in armor. Oh man. I didn't kill all of them. They almost fucking wiped me out the first time. <laughs> How are there more? I don't know. I guess you need to put your weapon away and walk around more basically, I guess. I guess. If you cared about this storyline, or if we could just fuck off and go. What? No, I don't care about this storyline. <clears throat> Sorry about it. I'm gonna do more good yeah, we by doing this. already took care of one group. Yeah, we took care of one, and we're gonna do more good right now than ever before. We're gonna save you from some slavers. Hopefully. Well, you don't have to wait very long for a remaster of this game, because it is coming out at some time soon, because they've announced it. I don't know. The only difference is, I think... I think they were, they were trying to say it was like... Okay, I, I might be completely remaking off, it. Mobile? No, no. I thought that there was like um, a mobile thing that they were doing with this game. Well, they they have mobile versions of it, yeah, on Is like the okay. iPad and stuff. But no, um, no, they announced that they're the company who rebooted 
or remastered another older game. What was it? Um, Knights of the <laughs> Old Republic remake. I have a uh, I have what's his face here, so now I can just look at him and be like, I killed them. You see this? Dolly, I killed them all. <laughs> Cuz they were bad people. Yeah, the uh the company that's going to be doing the remake is Asper, Aspire, um which did another game was You got any goods on here? Nope. All right. Oh, what's in the rubble? Nothing. Um, oh, I haven't gone that way. I don't know. I can't I can't find what the game that they did, but um yeah, they they're currently remaking it, I think. The only thing is I mean, you can get excited as much as you want, but I from what I heard too is they weren't keeping the gameplay the same. They were changing like the type, the game style, which is Why? weird. I don't know. I'm not sure how true that is either, but I just That's true, feel like yeah. I remember hearing that. But in right. theory, the story should be My the same, if nothing else. Error. Damage terminal. Playback calls you, Playback. I don't get it. That merchant said there was salvage down here. We need Matten to work the sensors. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh, good, it's Eli. Maybe he'll point us in the right direction. Playback. Eli, what are you... You got your money, you double-crossing snake. We had a deal. <gasps> Playback. I don't get it. <laughs> that merchant said there was salvage <sighs> stand. Playback. When playback. Playback. Sure. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure how it's gonna work. Hopefully, whatever they do is is good though. Um, I know that Asper has ported it, like these games too. I think I think they're the ones that did the mobile um, ports, which they've been on mobile for almost a decade now it's crazy how long they've been on the you know the apple store for who um the these games these games have been on the apple store for okay maybe not a decade but they've been on itunes for a while or not whatever i can't the app store i'm here oh, shoot we are almost dead heal heal What's going on over here? Oh! Oh, a dire Katarn. You know I'm going for it. Yes. That one's gonna be in stasis. By that one. Oh, man. Yeah, supposedly, yeah, uh, it says Stars of the Knights of the Republic remake rumored to be updated or the combat to be more action oriented okay uh, instead of like turn based it seems probably yeah how valid any of this is who knows hopefully it's true that the game itself is being remade and not also rumored mm -hmm. that. right now put that back in stasis and then put you back in stasis and then Put you back in stasis. <laughs> you get a stasis. You get a stasis. You get a stasis. Noise. So I watched. Um, after we finished playing two weeks ago, um, found a YouTube video of somebody speed running the very, very final boss fight, and literally, I'm here. Did it in like five minutes or less, where. Without giving anything away, he basically stun locked the the villain oh, and just no. and, and literally and and like one shotted him. Oh my god! Like that's one so one funny. shot with a lightsaber, just right, full right, right. health. That's insane. Or maybe it's too. Uh, it was ridiculous how fast. Just he a man, yeah. And he, and he didn't take any damage from it either. That's so, so crazy. But he definitely min maxed something there. So <laughs> right. They also had a ridiculously high yes. armor defense. Uh huh. I don't remember what it was, but it was high. And of course, he did other like 
status effects on himself to make himself boosted. Way better. Defense. Yeah, yeah. And he also gave him like like a not action surge type thing, but like a uh, a haste type ability. Uh huh. So he had like two, sh like extra time where he could do more things on himself before he attacked. That's crazy. Like, yeah. That one's coming. And then once that's done, then we're going here. Take All right, that. let's do it. <clears throat> Oh no! I must have saved. Uh oh. Nice. Oh, that one's dead. Cool. Oh, nice, dude. Speedrunning Shadow of the Colossus. We were just talking about that last Wednesday on our um our Sea of Thieves Let's Play. Yeah, uh, I had Johnny played it for my first beat. time. Yeah. But which that's Sabrina's like favorite game of all time. It's a lot of fun. I mean, it it was extremely f infuriating for yeah. some of it, but like it's a lot of fun. Not this again. It's really cool. Yeah, all the features that they they have for that game for how old it was. Like they had a lot of. Really, I mean, yeah. the, the original version of it anyway. I'm not sure how much was updated at all in the remaster other than just graphics. So they updated the game itself much. What? Yeah. Right. Man, they're going I swear, crazy. I'm gonna kill you guys. Corpse. What's on the corpse? Oh, nice. <coughs> we got 66 credits. Three less than 69. Four less than 69. All right. That's good. I've never played it myself. I've only watched Sabrina play uh, Shadow of Colossus a few times. Yeah. I've never personally played it. It's really cool because I like I like the whole, like, it's like a puzzle, basically, but, like, you're yeah. killing a Colossus thing. Rip. 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 Yeah, you're, you're so evil in that game, I feel like. I know. No, totally. 100%. Yeah. Not a good guy at all. No. Yeah. Yeah, I was watching that when she was playing how it did have some of those janky like, camera. Oh, God. Movements. The camera was one of the most infuriating things about it because you, you couldn't, like, you couldn't, like, keep it in one spot. It just kept on moving. And so you had to, like, focus on the camera as one of your, like, actions i guess you could say um like one of your things that you were doing was focusing on the camera and then moving around and then jumping and then grabbing on and just it was like see nothing's gonna be as bad as um this other game i'm gonna talk about actually i think we talked about it on one of our first let's plays maybe maybe it was a podcast i don't know um but the harry potter and the order of the phoenix game wasn't didn't you say that it was like turned into like an fps or something like that no no that's that's the last two games where it's basically like called duty or gear it's more gears of war i guess because it's a third person action that's thing. what and i just, wanted i wanted a gears yeah. of war harry, harry potter, potter game. game no no what we we're what we we're talking about though is like for the order of the phoenix game which they did such a great job creating the castle um mm -hmm. based on the like the movie's castle because um, the first two games, honestly, I think they're the best Harry Potter games there are. I think we talked about this already. I think so. Um, if not, just but, you and I talked about this. But, uh, you know, I love the first two. The first one, honestly, is the best one. Mm -hmm. And it's crazy. It came out in 2000, 2001, whenever the first movie came out. Crazy. And you could walk around and add a very, very tiny little castle map and stuff like that. But it, it was right. a, a thing. And you could look all up around. You could look up down. For whatever reason, in the fifth game, they had it so you had no control of the camera. It just you moved the character, and the camera kind of just moved around. Like, I was gonna say like Resident Evil, like the beginning ones, like where it was like in a fixed position, or they just like moved it. Um, here we are I think again. it was like following Shall the character, the but you couldn't you couldn't pass. look up or down, and that was right. so infuriating. I can manipulate it for a moment. Uh, let me see. 
How did the Zerg engineers do it? Ah, there we go. Now, keep moving. These are the most dangerous depths of Kashyyyk. Why are we going back this way? Surprises wait for us. So I'm going back to the... What's it called? Kashyyyk I think we're on the wrong people. way because... He... No, I'm pretty sure oh. this is the way to the... the Whatever it's called. Nope, not swoop bikes. Oh shit, did I go the wrong way? I think you did. Cause this is back to the Damn it, I did, to the didn't I? God damn it. Uh, Thought I was going the right way. Oh well. What's uh, just I was Potter I was speaking. lost in this in this interesting conversation about Harry Potter and all that like, jazz. So I I never That's the only Harry Potter game I never played or, there's two that I never played. I didn't play the Half Blood Prince game, which sucks because I really want to, because I think it had all the great things of the fifth game. And I don't know if they fixed the camera thing being mm -hmm. annoying or not. Um, and I never played Deathly Hollows Part 1. Uh, but I did play Part 2, and like I so said, that was where it was called. Gears Duty, of which, War. Yeah, it's so stupid. Like, it's just so uh. crazy that they thought that was okay. <laughs> yeah. To make a rapid firing machine gun wand. It's so weird. <laughs> like, literally never see that at all in any of the, the content of Harry Potter, and they're like, this is a good idea. This is what the people want. They want machine gun wands. I might get it, because, like, you know, the last book has a lot more combat stuff in right. it, but, like, it's not needed. I, there's ways you can do it to make it interesting, which I'm really excited about for the new Harry Potter or the, you know, Hogwarts the newest Legacy one. Game. Yeah. It looks really sick. It looks really good. It um, looks like the, the, um, Whoever the developers are put a lot of work into it. And that was just from like a, a teaser that I saw. Like it was. Yeah. It looks like it's going to be really good. Um, so I'm excited for whenever that comes out to see how the game play works for that. Um, Roar Woken. I'm not talking. Oh, I have to tell you. Spoof. Our spies say that the Mad Claw you were ah, la, 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 sent to blah, blah, blah. The phone fell. What did he say? He basically was saying, the the Mad Claw you're here to kill, you didn't kill him. Oh, cool, 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 so cool. So we're here so to I end have to kill you. them. Awesome. All right. Right on. Just all of you are going to get stasis. And then you particularly are going to get a lot of attacks. Oh, you didn't get stasis. <laughs> None oh, well. of them did. Yeah, but he has to go in turns, though, right? Oh, oh, okay. And didn't they recently announce the that they're doing a new um, Star Wars game too? I thought, like, uh. Oh, I did get them stasis. Those ones back there. Um, and then this one is going to just keep on hitting because that's what I do best. Okay, so here here are the five Star Wars games that are rumored as of May 7th um, to be in development right now. They are, in th theory, rumored to be working on... Oh, that's annoying. Um, in theory, working on a Mandalorian cool. um, game. They are Take working advantage on a Jedi Fallen Order 2 game. Cool. Yes. Yeah. Which is great. The Knights of the Republic remake. And then a High Republic game. And a High Republic? Yeah, and also Battlefront 3. Yeah, the High Republic, I think we talked about that recently. It's basically, um, unlike the Old Republic, where it's like 4,000 years before the original trilogy, this is like 300 to 200 years ish before the prequels in the Republic, so it's like the high time Republic. of the Republic. Yeah, exactly. And everything I've heard about, because there's been a lot of like books that have been coming out, because that's like their new era that they've been theming stuff around. Gotcha. And actually the new Star Wars Disney Plus show that'll be coming out sometime in the next year or two. Um, Star Wars Acolyte. Uh -huh. That's yeah. going to be taking place in the High Republic era. Interesting. Which Yoda, of course, would be alive at that point too. Right, remember. right, and he'll be he'll be in his youthful age of 
800. <laughs> yeah, right. How old was he when he finally died? He was 900. 900, yeah. Yes. So here's some interesting what? information too, which it can go both ways. I'm curious to see how it's going to pan out, but the newest controversy, because Star Wars is always baked in controversy. Of course. Of course it is. Um, Nothing big isn't. No. But Star Wars specifically has always been. Yeah. Like, Marvel, Marvel like, somehow avoids a lot of controversy. For the most part. I, True. I think I think, True. I think they've been attacked a few handful of times for various different things, but... For the most part, people are pretty chill with it. Yeah. Well, I mean, they're always they've always been really inclusive I in mean, their yes. shows. I mean, look at Loki for the first like yeah. first time ever a gender fluid bisexual or or pansexual un, unknown. Yeah. Really, but most mostly every, everybody Right, yeah. Um, <laughs> I keep seeing people like making memes about that. Yeah, it's so funny. Um, but like that was like a big deal, and everybody's like, "Let's go," you know. So I think that that's one of the things that they do really well is <clears throat> making that inclusive, and then so, bringing everybody to rally up and be like, "Marvel is good." So here's the newest controversy for Star Wars. Let's hear and it. The acolyte, which, <clears throat> like I said, is taking place during the High Republic. Mm -hmm. What they did is they they're bringing a whole bunch of writers in for the project who have never seen Star Wars before. Which I can see it going both ways. Sure, you get interesting new ideas, I guess. But like also at the same time, what people are really upset about is like you need to know the lore. You can't. You need to know some bit. You can't just have everybody not know. I mean, obviously there's going to be research that they do going into it, but still. But yeah, it's not the same. Like. The reason why the Mandalorian, the reason why the Clone Wars, Rebels, uh, and now Bad Batch and all those shows work so well is because they're made by people who know the right. lore. Like, right. and they, they love it so much. Like, right. Dave Filoni and Jon Favreau, they have such a, not Wealth obsession. Wealth of knowledge. But, but they're, they're, yeah, they're, they just care about it so much that that it yeah it, yeah it, it's that's why it's successful right yeah as much as about to be decided one only must lead us nice right. but it, it's it's definitely concerning that yeah <laughs> it's like uh it's like uh when m night shama llama 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 picked up uh avatar the last airbender avatar the last airbender without even fucking watching it and then being like this is what i'm gonna do See, the one thing I do have hopes for, though, is Dave Filoni got promoted to being, like, creative director of Star Wars. Uh-huh. Which is pretty cool. So, I, I think no matter what, he's going to be touching it anyways, which yeah. is great. But... I've held held by a true chieftain in recent memory. We both have our ancient trinkets, so who will be the people to follow? You or an old and weak? You, you are old and weak. Shut up, both of you! This ends today! I... I will not see blah, 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 suffer anymore! Yeah, you tell him, Zelbar. I... I don't know what to do, Spoof. <laughs> Chundara has been telling me things. He, he makes sense, I think. I don't know. What the f... Is this the best course? Without a doubt, Chundar is a slaver. <laughs> and there is no other way, Chundar. You have betrayed our people. You must pay. Way to go, Big Z. <laughs> and then he gets stabbed like <laughs> Big Z. That's my boy. You're too weak to fight, old Wook, and I still have Zerka support. We'll see who dies today. 
Oh. So, um, something else. He picked the wrong side. What? Yeah, no kidding. Um. So another thing. So the showrunner or like head writer, um, is Leslie Headland, who wrote Am like I the Bachelorette. All of these from people. Yeah. Oh shit! Um, I don't think I have enough stasis. And that's. Maybe I should go for this one. <laughs> Yeah, you'll probably have to figure out a different different project. But anyways, uh, Leslie Headland, which is another part of the controversy, is that she was chosen to be writing this show. Uh -huh. um, because here's where the, the big, big controversy is. She was Harvey Weinstein's personal assistant for six years. Harvey Weinstein, that's the guy that was an asshole and like sexually assaulted a bunch of people, right? Yeah. Fuck that guy. Yeah. So it's Kill like him. controversy wrapped up in controversy. Nice. It's like 50 cent over here. You like a controversy? I want to put your controversy inside of controversy so you can enjoy your controversy while you enjoy your controversy. It's controversy exception. Controversy. <laughs> Just beat these bitches up. Nice, he just got stasis. Yeah, he did. So that Wookie. Get him. Oh my god, mission almost died. <laughs> Take just have that. a Wookie just do like a around the head swipe and just lop her head off. <laughs> yeah. Just, just like, oh, okay, do I go to a different save file or Take that. get him! I think that one just died. Yep, looks like it. What a death. What? <laughs> just See, hopefully, what? <laughs> hopefully that's something they, they do update with the... Uh, the the animations and, yeah, and yeah. voices and stuff. Yeah. We should have... We have done it. I am saddened that it has come to this, but it... But I couldn't continue on. Ma, Zabar, my son, I am truly sorry. You have suffered a great shame. I was blind. I have no excuse. I can forgive, father. I have learned a lot over the years. What will you do now, Zalbar? I'm going to Disneyland. Turning home has lifted a great weight on my mind, but it has been painful as well. You have a place by my side, Zalbar. I would be honored if you would take it. I, I can't. Not yet. I'm just getting used to being free, and not just from slavers. And I have a life debt. Now, now that my life is truly my own again, honoring that agreement is all more important. Listen to my son. His insight humbles me. Take that good judgment with you, and all the planets will come to revere Wookiee wisdom. What will you do about the slavers? We'll fight them. It'll be difficult, but I swear they won't take another one of my people without bloodshed. I'll send quick climbers to other villages and try to rally a defense. We must guard against the ever happening again. From this ever happening again. You'll be the last outsider welcome here for a very long time. That is a change for the better, I think. Uh... Yep. Alright, I'll take a look. Or, I'll take my leave now. Before you go, Spoof, I must see to your reward. You've done a great service. The Sheik will remember you well for your lifetime. Because of you, I am reinstating, reinstated as chieftain. We will return to the old ways when honor and trust of kin ruled above all else. I'm not sure there is a reward that accurately reflects the value of what you have done. Our world has changed because of you. I have a request, Father. I have thought about it a great deal. I would like Bacchus' sword. That would be fit fitting, I think. <laughs> Zalbar, shut up! <laughs> that was one of the options. <laughs> well, that was quite a request. I am tempted to say no, but perhaps I should consider it an investment. Zalbar, do you understand what this will mean? It is a legacy of our people, held by chieftains and future chieftains. I understand. I want this, father. I'll bring it back one day. I have no doubt. Let the two halves of the blade be made one. My son shall hold Baka's sword. Nice. I gotta, I gotta bring, I gotta bring my boy Zalbar in here. 
Bye. No more stasis for you. No more stasis, but I got I got Baka's sword what? now. <laughs> Did you see we had two Zalbars? Oh, nice. I mean, now it's just one, but. Is it how much better is it than what he was just using? Uh, let's see. Because he had mission sword before. Thirteen to twenty-three and fourteen. Oh. Nice. Way better. Noise. Yeah, no kidding. Wow. How sleek. Is that like glowing stuff on there? I think it's just like uh oh, just like a paint job. Emblazonment. It's not glowing. Yeah. Uh, auto level. I don't want to do it. I don't want any part he, of it. Whoa. Uh -oh. He doesn't have force powers. Oh, your camera went off. I I'm dead. Johnny, your lights are off. I can't see you. It's dark. I'm dead. Hey, I'm here. Hey, you're back. I don't know what happened. I think I might have gotten off. There we go. All right, I think we're good. If it turns off again. Oh well. Mm. All right, let's see. I'm here. I can level up. Sure, why not? Hey, I'm a good Jedi again. Woo! Um, repair skill. Why not? Oh, master power attack. Nice. Oh, adds ten damage. Done. I think. What was it? What was it before? With your, your mid that? level. Uh, or plus good, two damage, but I always use whatever it's called. Um, Jedi Defense. That'll be next one. I'll get that one next. But uh, the middle one was plus eight, so now we get okay. a plus two anyway. So it's, so. Basic, it's basically the same uh, thing. Well, I mean, now now that I like actually, I should just do this one because that's just all around plus two, whereas this one I have to specifically pick that. True. So, I'll just do that. All right. Powers. Hmm. Was that heal? Oh, no. Right. I already did that one. Was that? Force Aura. Burst of Speed. Force Valor. Get Stasis. Yeah, he's using, like, Force Speed to haste himself, I think. And then he's using a Force Valor on top of that. And the Jeez. speed run ending. Shit. Just like all the status effects and yeah, then... but what he what he did is he he cast I think stasis on on the bad guy right. Then did haste, then did something else, then did the hey or stay or stasis again, so he'd have more time to right to do more. Yeah, it's crazy. Zalbar's bowcaster or Chundar's. Where is it? I literally just picked it up. It's it's uh you passed it. There I it saw. is. It's, oh nice. It's, is it better than the other it one? is? Yeah. Nice. Let's see. Go back. Just a. I guess when uh Zalbar was exiled, he had the bottom of the yeah. barrel. Yeah, apparently. What? Oh, what? <laughs> that or maybe there's like attachments on it that you could just take off. Maybe. Cool. All right, let's get on out of here, and let's get off this rock. And then we're going to what, Tantooine, you said? I think so. I think we said Dan Tantooine. We have that. We got, that. Ta -ta we got Manon, which is a water planet. When we got Dantooine. Oh, wait, no, Dantooine no, was the one before this. Yeah. Which is the planet of the Sith. <clears throat> There's Sith tombs there. It's pretty sick. That's sweet. Nope. I'm going the wrong way. Let me in. Let me in. I don't know what it is, but that meme of Eric Andre, where he's like right outside of the White House saying, let me in. Let me in. Every time just gets me. Every time I see it, without fail, gets a good <laughs> out of me. You know how memes like are. It's like you think they're way funnier than they really are, but like in reality, you're just like looking at your phone. And you're like, <laughs> and then you keep scrolling. I think I tried to send you two TikToks 
the other day. I'm not sure if they ever sent. They were having issues when I was trying to send them. Um, oh. It was a one of them was this. Lady. I remember the cane. Okay, yeah, that that one's a good one. one. And then did the little kid one send too? Where he, is the sound like? Oh, did you pee your bed last night? It's like, oh yeah, yeah, that one was good too. The kid is such a good little actor. He's gonna he's gonna go some places. That's for sure. Like, definitely. I believe you dropped this data pad, and I wish to return it to you. I didn't drop anything. <laughs> I don't want it. Take it. Take it. No. It's not mine. I won't take it. Take it. Ryan, take it. in reality, like, I don't want to take it, but, like, is it really super important to the story? Um, it's. It has something to do with, uh,. I don't remember. I don't know. I just remember that he shows up after he killed Kalanord. I don't know why or what it is. But. No. I don't want it. Bye. Hey, what if I talk to you again? Seni Vec. That's his name. Okay, I'll look it up. Wait, did I just? I just came from that. I feel like it's a way to just keep eyes on me. That was my first instinct from that. Now you listen here, Sandy Vex. Ooh, a backpack. Damn. Ooh, a corpse. I think I already looked at that too. Do you think they're gonna be really mad at me, the fact that I just, uh... Nah. Ended their company. Nah. At least on, 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 this, on this planet anyways. He'll be okay. Because this is the same company that Davik worked for. Oh, hey, Aww. look at that. Get him, Wookiees. Oh, I can't wait to kill that one dude. Oh, this is going to be great. Nice. Oh. Where are you? Ew. Oh, I'm, I'm coming for this guy. This is an intense battle. The maneuvers that they're using in this, I should be taking notes. Hey, look, it's Django. Kind of look like him. <laughs> Yeah. Honestly, I, I don't think it matters. Yeah. I think it would have been dark side stuff later on options, but we're not doing dark side really anyway. So. Well, hello, Wookie guard. Would have, like, asked you to kill somebody. <laughs> oh, whatever. I don't even care. <clears throat> Part of an assassinations guild. I mean, I'm always down for uh, for an assassinations or assassins guild. That's essentially what it was, I think. <clears throat> All right, how am I supposed to do this again? Oh, right, there's like a place that I can bring her, and she'll know. Something like that. I don't know. Oh no, that's right. The the droid that I'm supposed to repair is the one that's like the one that does mm. everything. Alright, galaxy map. Let's get off this rock. Let's part three. Yavin. Kotor part eight. What is Yavin? Uh it's like a trading post. I don't really need make. to go there. Uh I mean you can if you want to. It's up to you. You have a lot of money, I think. Oh, you can go Anon. there twice. Orban. Okay. Well, since Manan is the next one to the right, let's go there instead. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. It's a real, it's a real sound of what it sounds like. Spaceships, 
That's how they sound. I know, I've been to the future. And the past. In a galaxy far away. Zoomy. Zip. Boy, oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's another one of these. <laughs> <gasps> it looks like this was discovered already. What? Boy, where could it be? I wonder. On a water planet. Oh, it's super cool. Yeah, it's a pretty sick planet. Just for giggles, I'm going to look at the SW5E Cellcath, because I think that's a race that they made. From from here, yeah. Let me see what the stats are for it. Uh oh, you're not on the uh, captions anymore. The force is anymore. guiding us, helping us retrace the steps of Malak and his old master, leading us ever closer to the Star Forge. It is strange that anyone would have built a star map here. The entire surface of Manon is covered by nothing but vast oceans. Oh, there you are. Here you come. Holy crap, what the heck? It just like updated out of nowhere. Wait, what? You're, you weren't on the captions for uh, oh. a certain amount of time and then That's it weird. just like all of it at once. That's so weird. I mean, I did have a weird connection to the game here a second ago. Oh, gotcha. Maybe it was an internet thing then. Maybe. Or maybe it was me. Might've been me. So right. cell cats in, in SW5E gives you a plus two to intelligence and a plus one in, I think it said, um, charisma. They live up to 100 years, and they are typically be four and a half to five and a half feet tall, 130 pounds, and uh, they have a movement speed of 30 feet. They have a natural claw attack, and uh, they can temporary boost um, tech powers. Nice. And they have a swimming speed of 30 feet. Yeah, that makes sense. Looks like the star map was underwater. Vast, and much of it is uncharted, even by the native Selkath. But how <gasps> could Revan and Malak have found their way down? No doubt. I don't know. Maybe those breathing things that Obi Wan and, and Qui Gon used. Me, the god of breathing thing. They're called rebreathers. How creative of a name. Such a creative name. It is a cool piece of technology, though, where it just takes the oxygen out of the water. That's what it is? What it that does. makes sense. I think, yeah. I think so, yeah. So it's rebreathing the oxygen. <gasps> oh, well, hello, Julie. So you just think you can claim this room, huh? <laughs> Why'd you decide to come? Give yourself a fast little ship. <laughs> I forgot what engine sounded like. Closest thing to that on Kashik is an uller in mating season. Ugh, frightful. So you wanted to ride on my ship? Food? What's the gunk that comes out of a synthesizer on this bucket anyway? Do you never clean the darn thing? No, seriously, tell me. <laughs> I wish you could continue that conversation. I'm old, That's the part I'm more interested in. I'm allowed to be enigmatic when I want to be. And don't you go telling me otherwise. You know... You remind me of someone else I knew ages ago. Pleasant enough fellow, great destiny, all of that. Breath like a banther. Did you join, annoy this person endlessly too? Got him. You're so avoiding the question. Tell you what, when you get to be my age, you can go ahead and answer any question you like to. You have my permission. Anyway, where was I? Oh yes, Andor Vex was his name. The force swirled around him Yo. like a hurricane. That's, That's a, the last was. name of the other dude. Andor Vex, and then what's the other one's? What was the other dude? Uh, um. Sorry Vex or whatever. Sessy Vex. The dude oh, that just yeah, tried yeah. to give me the data pad. 
Yeah, this is where the data pad would have come into play, I think, here. No, you wouldn't have. Sometimes swirling force is just swirling force. It gets us old Jedi excited at our age, so we go, ooh, ooh destiny. And actually, it's Vec. Well, it turned out that okay. Oh, so is that what it was? A wee bit oh, okay. too much in the infallibility of that destiny. That overconfidence turned out to be his downfall. Did this story know. have a point? Are you overconfident? I hadn't noticed. Even if I had, I would never comment on it. We're talking about Andor, remember? Let's see. Oh, yes, <laughs> Andor's downfall. This guy's I was pretty young so subtle. Happened. At the time, I thought that Andor's destiny couldn't be more boring. How young are we talking? Well, let's just say that I was a strapping young lad with a full head of hair, and Coruscant was a small town with a well. <laughs> I was just about to abandon Andor to whatever the Force intended for him when his ship was overtaken by a Dimian warship. Now, you've probably never heard of the Dimians, but at the time, they were a nasty lot led by a nastier overlord named Krat. Tall fellow, big teeth. Krat has us hauled onto the bridge of his ship for questioning, and that's when I knew that Andor's destiny was at hand. <clears throat> Uh, Andor killed Krat, I take it? Of course he did. Haven't you been listening? It was not in the way you'd probably expect, though. Well, Andor decides that his destiny makes him invulnerable and starts making all sorts of demands. Free me now. I'm not answering questions. Blah, blah, blah. Don't you know who I am? Yeah. Krat decides he's had enough and begins crushing Andor's neck. I told the boy he should have kept his mouth shut. I think he agreed, too, or... Could have just been gurgling noises. No. Jesus <laughs> Finally, Krat has enough of Andor and tosses him aside <laughs> into this giant energy intake shaft. Nice. Andor gets sucked in and starts bouncing around, <laughs> screaming. <laughs> Maybe Andor hit something sensitive on the way down, or just didn't agree with the reactor. <laughs> Next, thing I love I this all guy. The alarms are ringing. You're kidding. Everyone panics and I run, barely making it to the ship in time before the explosion. Krat dies horribly, and the Dimians never quite recovered. Changed the political course of the entire sector for centuries to come. I'd call that quite a destiny, wouldn't you? <laughs> well, now that's the ingratitude of youth for you. I relate an exciting tale, and do I get thanked for it? No, no, it's all me, me, me. Uh, anyway, go on. My throat is dry, and you're making me cranky. Shoo! <laughs> well, excuse me, sir. You're on my ship. I know, right? <laughs> go on, get. <laughs> but as far but, as I sense, this isn't your ship at all. You just stole it. Oh, yeah, that's a fair point. Uh, yeah, that's fair. Okay. I did kill the person that owned it, so I think there go ergo. Actually, hey, I didn't kill grades? the person that owned it. Yeah. Fuck you, Candorous. I don't even know why you're here. You just like invited yourself. I do know why he's here. Oh, hello. Oh wait, no, you're already whatever. Yo, give me some grenades, bro. Which one is it? Number three. Yeah. Wait. Okay, we'll talk later. Oh, he said no. You got a bunch already. Got it. Alright, whatever. Fine, don't make me grenades, you, you bastard. What what mm. is your life debt for if you don't make me grenades? <laughs> Alright, let's do... Do Jolie again, for sure. Okay, I'll do that one. And I think, I think this is his planet where he does stuff. Gotcha, gotcha. We'll do Karth. Why not? <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I don't need mission anymore. Bye. <laughs> mission nor Zalbar. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I do need mission. She has Tatooine stuff, huh? This isn't Tatooine. Well, I know, but I mean, I'm just saying like later. I was saying that I don't need her anymore. Bastila, Bastila will be tattooing. So Bastila and Mission then? 
Yeah, probably. Because we got to talk to her brother. You Republic people are the so bro. pathetic, sitting around <clears throat> groveling at the table scraps that the Galactic Senators deign to give you. It makes me sick. The Senators work it for the good of the whole galaxy. Not the for Senators the work game. for the good of the galaxy. Ah, don't make me laugh, you gutless simp. It's the best. <laughs> I'll gut you like fish. <laughs> I don't know what a fish <laughs> is. <laughs> what is like that? Sith. I'm warning you. Don't push me or you'll get just what you're asking for. Try it. Just try it. I'd love to see you throw the first punch. And with all the cameras around, the Cellcath would be all over you inside of 30 seconds. You break their laws. You pay the price, Republic scum. But I can see that you're not man enough to back up your words anyway. If you ever feel like relieving yourself of your worthless existence, feel free to come by our enclave here. We have many, many ways to fulfill your wish. Okay. What a dick. <sighs> yeah, what are you... Oh, I apologize, Master Jedi. I should not have been rude. Is it... Is it that obvious? As I hold a lightsaber in my hand. It's alright. No need to worry. Master Jedis are here to save the day now. No, really. I should apologize. I, I should try to control myself, as you Jedi do. Is there anything I can? Do? <laughs> yeah. I, like, I just imagine me coming out with like a beer and being like, "Hey, what up?" Oh, I should. <laughs> sorry, Master Jedi. Nah, dude, it's it's fine. Well, I, I should be sorry. I I uh, want to control myself like you you do, bruh. Take a big swig, big old burp. Nah, you're good, dude. I'm not even a Jedi. They just wanted me here for some reason. <clears throat> oh, I, I just got a lightsaber from course. the Jedi I killed, well, actually. Know, have a pleasant stay. Bye! Alright. Oh my god, Karth, of course something's <laughs> bothering you. Something's yes, always please. bothering you, you little yeah, angsty boy. Haven't had him for a while, so he has a lot to catch up on. You've been very quiet lately, you know that? I know, I haven't been here. <laughs> have I been quiet? I suppose I have. I guess I just don't like being left out of the loop. What the? You're born out of the loop? Bitch! You're born out of the loop. <laughs> I'm not the one leaving you out of the loop, Karth. Left out of the loop? What left do you mean? out of the loop, you know, not being told anything strung along. It's really starting to irritate me. For one thing, I want to know what the Jedi Council said to you. They pulled you in there and refused to tell me a thing about it. I'm Fuck, I'll tell you. to know what went on and why they didn't keep you on down to for training. Isn't that strange? And why is that? You were a great help on Terrace, but why would they keep you with us? Don't they? Don't they have to train you? They said there's a bond uh -huh. between Bastila and myself. Of, you mean to say that they told you that you were tied to Bastila in some way? <laughs> I have trouble believing that. You're a neophyte Padawan who's been saddled with the responsibility of tracking down these star maps. Why? That's not normal. I am not I don't trying fucking to know, bro. you or to imply that you're somehow responsible for the Jedi Council. Oh, okay, cool. Give me a hand here. There has to be a reason. You're saying I'm not needed? Well, there's no snow going to change you over. I'm sick of this. I don't like any of these options. None of them. I'm. I would like to say, like, what do you mean? What what kind of reason do you think there's alter ulterior motives to the Jedi Council? Bastila and I have a bond. And sure. what does that mean? Well, is this more of that destiny garbage that the Jedi keep talking about? Well, that can't be it. Well, I'll tell you this much. I'm not going to wait around until I'm betrayed again. Oh my god, this again, you little angsty boy. <laughs> I'm he's not just, gonna betray, betray he's just you. He's doing what his character would do, Johnny. <laughs> yeah, we'll just see about that, won't we? Look, I didn't mean it that way. I want to get to Saul, not... No, no, forget it. It just seems that all I can do is insult you, isn't it? Just forget I said anything. Let's Let's just get on with what we were doing. Man. Carson okay. Such a flip floppy little 
I know. I thought we were Dip fine bag. at the end of it, and then and then he just like wants to bring up old news, like shit, son. He just has PTSD, is all, man. He's. he's I a, mean, I get it. He's, but he's like, a veteran that's gone through a lot, you know. Yeah, but that doesn't mean that he gets to treat people like shit. <laughs> has he? Did he? Did he fully tell you what happened yet? Like to his. That is. That is. Uh, Dude, like, changed, like, right when the Sith came on and, like, just basically yeah. killed his entire fleet or whatever. And his family. Greetings, human, and welcome to Otto City. Visitors Provisional Stand. We are here to provide visitors with all manners of indigenous treats and products produced right here on Manan. We carry all manners of food and provisions and have contacts and with resellers across the world to provide you, the customer, with the best shopping experience possible. Hey, there's some fish right there. How is it oh, that yes, Auto City cousin. Provisional Company can help you today? <laughs> um, let me see your inventory. He was mouthing off to me, so we cut him up. <laughs> Advanced med pack. Advanced repair kit. No. All right, I'll take that. How many do I have? Can I see how much I have? Oh, I only have like 6,000. You can hit show cell list. You can see how many you have. You have 16 spikes. And <laughs> oh, we have a lot of stuff. I mean, granted, you go through them pretty freaking fast. But. Uh, let's go to med packs. Man, you're really blunt for your money. I think that's I'm good. also not really sure what else you'd use money for, though, really, so. Yeah. I could buy armor, but all the plot armor is better. And I mean, like, plot armor as in, like, <laughs> armor that I get from doing the plot, not that yeah. I'm a character that they're keeping alive for no reason. Uh-oh. Didn't mean to do that! <laughs> Can we turn around? Hey! Level up on... Oh, both of them. Cool. Oh, I guess we just forgot, because I think we, we didn't do it last time, did we? Well, Good Karth... thing it lets us know every time we go into a new area. Yeah, Karth uh, needs a level up, because I haven't been with him in a while, but this boy needs a level Manual. up, because... Sure, why not? Skills. Yeah. Master yeah. Force Sense. Yeah. Or Force Focus. If you focus. highlight it, can you see what it does? Oh, I don't know. I oh. wonder if it just gives you more Force Points. Master Dueling. Master conditioning. Where the hell did it go? Wait, wait, go, go, go back up. Did he have a better healing? Oh no, no, he doesn't. I was just seeing the one that's selected right there. This uh, one? Oh, that's conditioning. Oh, these are feats. Yeah, these aren't force powers. What's what is the uh the his master force focus thing that he just Oh got? oh it, I already have it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I was looking at like other ones and I was trying to figure out if I had to get it. Uh this feat adds oh. plus four Sick. to the difficulty class the, for all saving throws. Plus three, probably. Plus two, so it. twice as much. Nice. And then so the master people sense will have a hard time, I guess, uh saving for his stasis. Yeah. Plus six defense. Always active. Nice. Okay. Can I get one new one? Yeah. Two weapon fighting? No. Because those are your class ones. Right. Critical strike. Empathy. Gearhead. What is that? Conditioning? Unplanned power attack. You get one that increases his health if he doesn't have toughness already. He does have toughness, to. but oh, oh is that that's it? a good one. That do the blaster one. That one sounds like a good one for him. The the um the Jedi defense, yeah, yeah. 
Here, hold on. What is this? Master dueling. Because he's going to be mainly Plus three fourth to base. Attack and and longer defense. You can keep yeah, no, I know. Then what is that? Melee weapons. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Now I can get that, the healing. So that's good. Let's do that. And accept. Cool. And now. Nice. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Auto level. You're not. You're not that good. You're not that good. What? You're not that guy. See, the only thing you're is when you guy. do the auto level. I mean, you could click the level up and you just hit auto, do it while you. That way you can see what they get. You know? Yeah. What? Something about cameras. Well, hello. Oh, it's a Sith soldier. I don't have time to listen to your stories. I've got a full shipment of Kalto ready to load before my shift is over. But it's not official Sith business, though. What about you? I don't have time to listen to your stories. You have the same voice. Kalto ready to load before my shift is over. Because the twins? Security cameras back on. You're both a bastard. True that. Got him. Busted. See, Colto right. is is the healing liquid in in Star Wars. I thought that was Bacta, but then Bacta is well, like okay. A... Well, Bacta and Colto, they're they're like two different healing things. Gotcha. So yeah, there's the Bacta tanks, which is what Luke was in, and then there's Colto, which I think is like the older versions uh -huh. of them. Let me guess. Let me guess. Damn! Damn! Mission, come here. Mission. Mission, we need you. It's impossible. Can't Just hack the this. droid. Have the cleaning droid yeah, access there you go. It with its key card. All right. I don't think this door opens. I just wanted to check. Cool. Okay. All right. We have finally gone through all of this. Can you talk Let's to the cleaning droid? I can try. Hello? Well, hi. Nice. Such a nice security droid. In reality, he's like, you motherfucker, don't even fucking talk to me. <laughs> Good thing I don't speak droid. You are the scum beneath my boots, mortal. <laughs> Fleshling. Oh, man. Yeah, I feel that. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks, fam. I don't even have to open it. What's up, dude? How you doing? Yeah. What do you? He looks like a black Volker. Why do I look like a black Volker? What are you doing here? <laughs> Just walk <laughs> up to this guy and start asking him questions. <laughs> no, nothing, dude. I'm not gonna. Wait. Do you want me to talk to you? Who are you? Mmm. Mm. Sure, let's do it, dude. I'll lose. <laughs> yeah, I got I got money to blow. Chosen oh, cards. Add, add, yeah, choose choose the plus one, minus one. If you could get like a whole deck of just plus minus ones, that'd be perfect. Of course those cost more money. Perfect. That's that's good, right? Yeah, that's probably fine. Because at least you have cards that you can keep subtracting things if you go over. I'm gonna do that. Alright. Alright, let's do this. You're not even ready. Um. Yeah. Hi. End turn. Right? Yep. Stand is like, I'm done. End turn yeah. is like, wait for yeah. the next one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice. What do I need? Uh, 20. 20. Okay. So you could either stand. So if I stand. Or you could do the plus two. Yeah, why not? Why would I hold it? Bitch. Hey. It would have beat me anyways. So it's a good thing I did it. End turn. End turn. 
end turn. <laughs> Yeet! <laughs> Oof. Damn. And he has a card too. End turn. End oh, yeah. turn. Oof. Nope. Not for you, because you can't. That Not that one. Okay. Yeah. That's okay. Sick. End turn. Oh no. It's a plus or minus six? That's crazy. Well. Oh! No way. There's no way. Yeah. Huh. There's no way. Last chance. Dude, you're getting such small cards. Oof. That is rough. He has one card left, though. I yeah. had to. I had to. Yeah. yeah. Nice job, dude. Here's your four hundred dollars. All right, last one. Um, I'm gonna take away that three though, and I'm gonna do that. Pizak is. I I love how it's it is blackjack, but it has a variation to it that's interesting. What is flip hand card? Um, what that means is uh, is that for this have, the plus one? Yeah, the plus one or minus one. Yeah. Got it. Okay. So you flipped it, it would change it to minus. But you gotta do it before you play it because right. you don't get the option. I found that out the hard way. <laughs> Oof. Well. I don't want to lose that one. All right. End the turn. Oof. Ah, uh, what is that? That's it? Really? No waste it on that? Well, he didn't want you to win either. He did the same thing you did. It's all right. It's all right. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, no. Hey, look at that. You can... You guys You're have not two winning each. this time. Yep. Oh, you must... Oh. I'm gonna regret it. Nope, I'm hey. not. Hey! Oh. No one's won a round yet. And you guys are almost out of cards. It's all gonna come down to the luck of the draw. Damn it! Uh, yep, you lost. See, and you can just stand whenever. That yeah, sucks. That does suck. That's. Does he ever go first? Because that's a crazy advantage. Yeah. So dumb. Yeah. That's a crazy advantage. He just gets it every time because I don't know what he's going to do. So dumb. No kidding. Whatever. Yeah. Ugh. He can just stop. The dumbest shit. Whatever. I don't want to fucking no, play I don't you anymore. I don't want to play with you anymore. You took my money. I'm all right. I can kill you. <laughs> come back and just steal it all from him after killing him. Take it off his dead we're gonna make, corpse. We're gonna make a Jeff out of him. True that. Hello. Welcome to Manan. While you are here, I trust that you follow all the rules governing the activities of off-worlders. What are the rules? Single most important law in Manan is very simple. Kalto smuggling is punishable by death. If you're carrying any unprocessed Kalto, you better have a permit. The other rule is also very simple. Keep the peace. Here on Manan, we maintain a careful neutrality and we react very harshly to people who jeopardize our neutral status. 
Any confrontation between the Sith and Republic are dealt with swiftly and decisively. Is this understood? Yes. There's a dock fee of 100 credits. You will have to pay the fee each time you dock on Manan or will be permitted into Alto City. Well, make it 50. I'm not gonna do that. Goodbye. Yeah, okay. All right, fine. No! Oh, okay, fine. Oh, thank you, Outworlder. Cool. Now open to you. Go as you please. Sweet. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. Hello. Hi, everybody. Welcome yeah, so, uh, <laughs> the whole reason why they uh, we're talking about Colto, though, this is where they, they get Colto. So. Got it. Hello. Hello. Motherfucker. Then we'll see how long their vaunted neutrality lasts. Okay. They'll see the true power of the dark side. True that. She I'll show you the true power Not of the dark side. Sith business. Hmm. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go here. I just know that I'm supposed to go and like look for the, the thing, right? Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, let's explore a little bit before going into anywhere. Dude, this map, if they remake it, though, awesome, looks so beautiful. Can, does this open and then... Oh, okay, cool. I can just, like, walk in. Well, hello. I don't want to talk to any of you. Why are they all staring at the wall? Oh, you know. The wall's pretty interesting sometimes. They, they didn't want to talk to each other, so they're looking away. Official Sith other. business? Damn it. You? How about you? A Sith, Sith business? Wow, oh, okay. Whatever, I'm not interested in talking to you either. Ah, shit. Oh, well. That was pretty much it. Yeah. I either go east or west. Him. Okay. Hello, Elora. I feel like I need to talk to you. Yes, you. I... I need your help. Elora? Of all the people... <gasps> how did you even know I'd left Kashik? I didn't. Nobody knew where you were, not even Sunry. But I heard the Selkath mention you and your friends. The Force has brought you to help us. Why? Whatever could be the matter, my dear? Oh, it's horrible, Jolie. Sunry has been arrested. <gasps> the Sith have accused him of murder. <gasps> but how? It's not mistake, Sunry! Jolie. Sunry isn't a murderer. Someone is trying to frame him. Calm down, Elora. We're Sunry now. Sunry's we'll being held in the Selkath courts. <laughs> they won't let anyone in to see him. Please. You know how Please. Jolie thinks about murderers. Talk to the judges. Maybe the cell He's alright with him. He, he'll give you a good stern talking to, but if after that, it's like whatever. You know what I bought at the store recently? Hmm. I uh, I bought some some lunchables. So, do we have a deal? That's an awful and they lot are of money. good. Yeah. Is there something yeah. you're not going back to that kind of? Oh yeah. Heck yeah. I, I walk by it at the store every once in a while. I'm like, well. yeah. Sense, I guess. I, I like the, the cracker money. ones. Those are yeah, like the cracker stuff. turkey Just and ham ones. Yep, yep, yep. Tomorrow and speak to our representative there. Oh, I'm sure we're even talking about. He wants you to start on right away. Sorry. No, it's fine. I don't even care, honestly. I mean, if it was important, it would have been a quest thing that popped up. Yeah, exactly. Human, I wish to speak of to you if you have the time. Don't you know it's rude to talk to somebody if they're not interested? That's what somebody else said. Yes, it's beautiful. I true, it's truly a wonder to behold. That's how I'm gonna say it, headcanon. You're too gracious, human. Obviously, he doesn't understand sarcasm. The beauty of Manan is delicate. Our ecosystem is complex and fragile, and I fear for the preservation of my planet. What are you talking about? There is a task I would ask, human. Ah, that rhymes. Jedi. I fear there is no one else I can turn... What do you want me to do? Rest assured, there will be ample reward for this, human. I only require information, nothing more. The Republic has been hiring mercenaries, many more than usual. As an official... As an official of the Selkath people, this is of great concern to me. I only seek the reason for this change in the Republic policy. 
Why do you need this? I cannot trust anyone else. The Republic obviously wants to keep their secret. I have inquired often as to their purpose and been rebuffed. The Sith cannot be trusted to give me an accurate report of events. They will twist the truth so it will further their own goals. And the mercenaries are well aware of the high wages the Republic is paying. They would not report anything that might slow the flow of credits into their accounts. Uncover the truth behind the Republic's actions and I will pay you 500 credits. With spies <laughs> the Republic. Chump if, change. If we could assure the Cellcat that they mean no harm, then perhaps it might be worth it. Please, see if you can find the answers I seek. Find why the Republic is hiring so many mercenaries. Find where they are going. Find why they want- do not return. I'll look into it. I am a Republic mercenary. Fight I know, me. like, how do- How does this person think that I'm just not with any of them? Greetings, human. My name is Shaylas. I have heard it said that you are no friend of the Sith. Is this true? Actually, I kind of like the Sith. They got style. My allegiances are my own business. You are wise to be so guarded, but sources are rarely wrong, and they have informed me that you are no friend of Malik's either. Who's Malik? The bad guy. Oh, right, 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 the bad guy. I know the Sith do not respect our laws as the Republic does. We're up, word up to me, I would do everything in my power to save the Republic in the war against Malik. But intergalactic policies stay my hand. Still, I know the Sith are evil, and I fear that they do will do to my people and what they may be doing now. What are you talking about? Many of cell cats have vanished. Human have vanished. Human. Oh. Most who have gone missing are on the cusp of adulthood. The youth who someday lead this planet, my own daughter Shasa, is among those who have disappeared. These disappearances coincide with the arrival of the Sith. I cannot dismiss the connection. The Sith are up to something human, something sinister. I can feel it. You want me to investigate? I'll give you 500 credits. Wow, it seems to be just like a overall thing. Find a daughter. Cool. No one else can I can turn to. I'll look into it. All right. Let me you guess. One more. Here we go. The Sith organization for one such as you. Your offer is pretty good, but I've heard some nasty things about you, Sith. Is it true you bomb Taris into dust? This yes. is war. In war, certain distasteful acts cannot be avoided. But ask yourself this: When we win the war, would you rather be against the Sith or with us? You make a good point. And I've never turned down a job that pays up front. Excellent. Report to the Sith Embassy tomorrow for your assignment. Cool. Nice. So I guess the other one was Republic people getting mercenary, and then now it's the Sith getting a mercenary and just talking to people. Cool. Mm -hmm. Good world building. Hello. Filling out the map. Don't mind me. I was gonna say something. Um. Filling out the map. I can't for the life of me remember what it was then. The now. Republic respects the peace of Otto City, Your Honor. But the Sith are a violent people who leave violence in their wake. I have three soldiers in the infirmary. If the Republic's soldiers were more capable, they would not have suffered such serious injuries. Are my soldiers to be punished simply because they won a fair fight? I hardly call six against three a fair fight. The Sith are cowards who attack only when they have the advantage of numbers. Oh. What's up? No, we got this. No. I'm aware of the Republic's indignation. However, witness reports clearly state Republic soldiers were willing to engage in violence as a Sith in this case. They were provoked, Your Honor. The Sith goaded them into this fight. Taunts and threats are not sufficient provocation. Prov provocation? Yep. In the eyes of the court, words can be ignored, which is what your men should have done. I find both the Republic and the Sith to be equally at fault with for this breach of the peace. I should throw all parties involved into the Otto City Jail, but since no Cellcath were harmed in this conflict, I will show mercy and levy a fine of 10,000 credits to both si Oh my god! Yo, they're just making bank off of these people. Money, 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 money. 
Holy um, what I was gonna say is just a reminder though. So yeah, Malak was Revan's Sith apprentice before he Revan that's was right. the Malak's the destroyed. dude with the, with the face that talks like this. Yeah. <sighs> before Malak betrayed Revan and sell calf guard. What do we got in here? Oh crap! Sometimes you just gotta ask, right? Can I go in there? Alright, I'll be leaving then. Was it locked? Can you go invisible? It was locked. Mm. Plus, I don't think I can go invisible as... As spoof. So I'm guessing that I should probably come, come and talk to these people. Hello! My task and needs off blah 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 uh, blah 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 another party you should speak to me you should first however consult with the public embassy before pressing formal charges is there something you wish to bring to my attention Sunry that is acceptable I believe in non legal traditions the defendant can have an arbiter who tries to prove his innocence in court the arbiter is a neutral party that can investigate and present evidence in the trial and argue on the defendant's behalf are you a Jedi I believe you could fulfill the role adequately Sunry's only hope we have to at least try to help him I gotta just cut yeah Sweet, I'm an arbiter now. Ah, oh, shoot. That was important, huh? Important. Found dead of a blaster wound with incriminating Republical Republic metal clutched in her hand. This information had been uploaded to your data pad. It would be wise to review all the information before it starts. You may question Sundry or the witness. The evidence in this case has heavily stacked against Mr. Sundry. I believe it will take some some doing to absolve yes, him of guilt. <clears throat> too heavily stacked, doesn't it? You may also interview the judges here, including myself, to get an idea of the pertinent factors in this case. Since this is also your first case, you are an off-worlder. I feel compelled to add good luck in my final missive. I can right. see the title for our next part on Friday. Objection, your honor! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna go talk to him first. Hello. Uh, Hi, he Lord. said Alessa is dead. What? Probably. Need, I thought in the thing it said Alessa was shot dead with a blaster. Room. That's the lady you talked to. Oh, Alora? Oh, then run. I thought I said. I thought her name was Alessa. Talk to the oh. guy. Oh. Oh yeah, right. I'm an arbiter. If you wish to begin your trial, you must take the I'm request of the warden. I'm official arbiter business. <laughs> <laughs> showing your ID. <laughs> Just have it on like a little like lanyard. Yeah. Yep. Arbiter business. Prisoner. Hi. Uh, when I get out of here, you're dead. I'll gut your fishy little corpse, cut off your head, and bathe in your blood. Oh, got it. Okay, I was like, me? I didn't do shit to you. I'll bathe in your blood. This is the guy that they're framing, this Kill old me. dude? What are you doing here? Laura sent me summary. I'm here to get you out of this mess. <clears throat> the courts went and made us arbiters for your case. Just like old times, eh, Jolie? You come swooping in out of nowhere to save my tail from the fire? You saved my wrinkle butt more than a few times as well, friend, if I recall. But there'll be time he for catching up later. Butt. Right now, we need to focus Gross. on the case. The case is a complete frame-up. Nice. Anyone looking at the evidence could see that. Or so I thought. But the cell cast seem to think that there's... Well, if there's enough to go to trial, there aren't any witnesses. Mm. All that evidence against me is circumstantial and completely flawed. What? Just admit no to the way. thing you did it. Let's go over the evidence, well, shall just we? Tell me, just tell me why you did it. I admit, and I did meet Alasa there that night, but it's not what you think. <gasps> I was working with Republic intelligence. <gasps> we were pretending. Didn't to see that coming. The Sith. Well, I turned Alessa into a double agent working for us. It was going well, too, until she turned up dead. Hmm. Maybe the Sith had found out I was turning her and had her eliminated. 
But let's look at the facts they've given. Alassa was brutally killed. Think about that. She was a Sith, trained in battle, and I'm just a crippled old man. My war injuries make it difficult for me to walk, even to hold things. See how my hands are shaking? How could I kill a Sith warrior at close yeah. quarters? I ask you. And just like, Further, see how my hands are they shaking? Say they found my heroes cross at the crime scene. Could I leave my war medal behind if I killed someone? Even I'm not that stupid. Obviously, the Sith planted the cross. And what about the lack of forensic evidence? Skin and hair samples, clothing fibers. Why isn't there anything like that at the crime scene? Sounds like an obvious frame up to me. I hope you can see how the Sith are manipulating the cell cat, and probably even you to set up this against me. We need to get this over with quickly and clear my name. Anything else I can help you with? I want my arbiter to be well prepared before we go to trial. No, oh, I am so prepared for trial. You don't even understand. I think you have your a whole bunch of stuff in your journal that you could look at too. Yeah, they were saying that I could talk to the judges too. Um, I need to investigate it some more. Any ideas where I should look? I have a few things that I want to clear up. Uh, let's. Yeah. I guess you could interview witnesses at the hotel where the murder happened. Selkath already did that, but the fish folk don't have much rapport with offworlders. Maybe one of them was holding something back. But I think you'd be better off investigating the Sith themselves. Maybe you could find some proof oh, they planted go over evidence well. to frame me. Though that Sith might business? mean figuring out a way into the Sith embassy. Anything else I can help you with? I want my arbiter to be well. I feel like you've said that before. Um, that's, that's what we need to sell when we get merchandise, is not just a shirt, but like a lanyard. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, ask. Ask what you need Like to. an official looking, hide. official Sith yeah. business thing. And just flip it around and it says, official arbiter. They said that you left after the shots know. were fired. They weren't there. I yeah, well, some of the witnesses oh. said that too, but I swear she was alive when I left. I wonder if the Sith had been putting pressure on people to get them to convict me. It wouldn't surprise me at all. They've had it in for me since the war. You should ask everyone about that. They might admit to helping the Sith under pressure. Oh, so put pressure on them to admit that they were working for the Sith. At gunpoint. Got it. Very well. I suppose there is still much you must do before the trial. Once you've gotten enough evidence to go to trial, just tell the warden we're ready. The sooner I get out of the cell, the better. Here, I, I have, think I have, I'm ready I think enough. I have, a way, I, have a way, I, have, I have a way to solve this. Here, take this this metal cylinder. It's like a new updated um, microphone. Hold it right up to your mouth and push this button to talk into it. <laughs> I'm in this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, problem solved. <laughs> yeah, Alora. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sundry He's died. Guilty. All right. Republic negotiator. Where's the hotel that I have to go to? Uh, probably it's on the, the other side. side of the east. Yeah, probably. That's probably All where right. the hotel. That's probably where the embassies are. Yeah, let's go do it. Let's go take a look. Thirty minutes left or so. See how far we get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what a view. It makes me think of Stargate Atlantis a little bit. Because <clears throat> I imagine if they ever made a Stargate Atlantis game, that's exactly what we'd get. Yeah. With the view. I guess depending on the when the timeline of when the game would be taking place. Right. Because Atlantis is not on a water planet the entire show. They mm -hmm. go into space eventually. Your previous <gasps> Republic's days are numbered. Long until Malak turns his armada loose on Coruscant itself. Save your empty threats, Sith scum. Malak isn't stupid enough to attack the core worlds, now with the entire Republic fleet waiting for him. You're a fool. When the Sith descend on Coruscant, our numbers will block out the sun itself. The galactic senators will collapse trembling in fear and beg for mercy at Malak. No, no, you don't kill me. To resolve. We'll die before we surrender Coruscant. That can be arranged. Remember what happened to Taris. Malak could do the same to the core worlds. He wouldn't dare. 
Now it is you who underestimate our resolve. It's like West Side Story. Yeah, basically. Yeah, and then they start snapping and getting away from each other. <laughs> Hi, Halas. A human? There are Selkath everywhere, but you chose to speak with me? Am I so different? Do you think I have answers the others do not? No? Alright, fine. I was just... I was just okay. And so you leave. Perhaps to return, perhaps not. Yet I will remain here, for my work is not done. Cool. So sounds good, dude. You do that. Oh, I love doors. I love doors. I love refrigerators. Have you ever seen that? No. Oh, it's so funny. It's just this dude walking down a, a long, like, Home Depot kind of, like, aisle, yeah. right? There's a line of refrigerators. And he's just walking. He's super happy. He's like... And he's like all the way back there, right? Like hundred feet, maybe more. And he just walks the entire way. There's no music, no anything. And you could just hear tap, tap, tap of his feet. And then when he's finally up to the camera, he puts his hand on a refrigerator. He's like, I love refrigerators. And that's it. <laughs> that's the ad. It's the funniest thing. Cause you're like, was, why is he walking up to the the camp? What is he doing? I and was that's um, it. so Jolie, you decided thinking. to leave your little hermitage in the forest and come help us stop the sis. <clears throat> I guess you realized this was worth coming out of retirement for. Huh? I didn't talk yeah, to you. That's right, Sonny. The Sith are the greatest they're evil to hit to the other. galaxy since well, the Mandalorians, and they're the worst thing since Exar Kun. Blah blah blah, etc. 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 Okay, old man, you lost me there. Are you trying to make a point? Look, everybody always figures the time I know. they live in is the most epic, most important age to end all ages. But tyrants and heroes rise and fall, and historians sort out the pieces. Um, what I was gonna say, I was thinking of a TikTok. Um, I'll send it to you later. But uh, Devin Palmer, shout out to him, D E V O N underscore Palmer, I think, and he uh, he does a whole bunch of different really funny little skits and one of them is he opens up a, a present and it's a bag it's just, uh, uh, I love bags and I was like no take take it out it's inside the bag no I don't want to I don't want to <laughs> and he takes it out it's another bag I love bags <laughs> that's so dumb <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure the Malik is the Malik tyrant is in this case should be stopped if he conquers the galaxy, we're in for a couple of rough centuries. Eventually, it'll come around again. But I'd rather not wait that long. So Man. we do what we have to do, and we try to stop the Sith. But don't start thinking this war, your war, is more important than any other war just because you're in it. That's an interesting theory, but I don't buy it. The Republic stands for something. It stood for something for 15,000 years. And if it falls, everything will change forever. You believe whatever you need to get through this, Sonny. The bottom line is we both want to stop Malik, so let's not get hung up on the details. Let's just get back to stopping him. I mean, yeah. he's not wrong. Jolie's pretty wise. I mean, literally, that's exactly the entire Star Wars saga in a nutshell. Yeah. Nothing really matters because it just it's a cycle. Mm -hmm. Things are always going to happen. The world is Power not going to look shift. like what it is now. In like 200, 300 years from now, it's gonna no. look completely different. Which like, is crazy. it's insane. <laughs> All the hey, oceans are gonna be this risen and Sith evaporated. Only. You gotta pay a 20 credit toll to walk down this street. <laughs> Yo, okay. To just like <laughs> flex on him. I hope it doesn't like attack them. It might. It's a public street. Hiding behind the cell cat laws. Typical Republic cowards. I mean. The fuck? You want me to, like. Sure, call me a coward. Dumbass. <laughs> They're just asking to be killed. It's like. Like. I have no desire to speak to you. I know you have links to the Republic. 
I wasn't going to talk to you. Just walks up to her, push her over the edge. Yeah. Ah! Force, just pick her up and throw her off. So yeah, fourth push. Dude, uh, I wish this was like Baldur's Gate where you could just. Yeah. Have you so Shove people. Yeah. All right, there's nothing That's here. That's literally no, the best it's... part of Baldur's Gate. They oh yeah, it's great. it's a great part about it. If they didn't have the shove, it would be. It'd be the worst game. Like, who would ever play that game? No. Terrible. It's like the worst. Especially because it's not on PS4. Yeah, it's especially since, I mean, it's not like I have like 100 hours in it or anything. <laughs> Which is crazy we played it that much. It's it's fun. <laughs> it is good. It is really good. You got right, any armor plating for my spook bike? Oh, this guy. <laughs> just, just kidding. <laughs> no. I don't think he's the same exact person. I really hope Got that he's not the dude. From my swoop bike. I thought this garbage was free. You actually sell this junk, you fish. You want to just lock the door? I got it. <laughs> Don't Say worry, junk man. Hi, junk man. I mean, yeah. sir. Hi, I'm Spoof. That's the nature. That's the name of my my name. That's what it means. I'm gonna spoof you. Ha ha! Please forgive me. I had no cause to be rude to you. Blah blah blah. blah. It's been slow, but no excuse for my tone. I apologize. It's okay. Your tone sounds exactly the same now. So I don't <laughs> yeah. worry about it, bro. I don't understand your language. Let's talk to second hand, some minor damage, but for the repairs I've done with them. Good new a fraction of the price. I don't want any of that. Except maybe heavy plating. Yeah, it's computer spikes. Oh, I have so many of those, I'm good. I know, but he had it discounted though. Meh. Meh. I don't even care. There wasn't oh. a way to go that way, right? Oh, there was. What's this way? Oh, wow, it's a Sith Wardroid. Yo, I saw those in uh, Mandalorian. Those are so sick. Official Sith business. I know you. You're the arbiter in the murder trial. Elasa was a friend of mine. If there's any justice in the galaxy, they'll feed Sunray to the Phyrexans. Shouldn't you be preparing for the trial? What are you doing here? I was just... I have business with the ha. Sith. We know who we have business with. If you don't know how to get in, then we don't want anything to do with you. Now back off. I'm here to talk to you. That's how Joe, I'm getting in. Stay. It doesn't matter to me. If you want to, you can even wander up to the embassy gates. <laughs> but don't expect to get inside. Bzz, let me inside right now. <laughs> Mm. Dang it! He was <laughs> right! <laughs> just look at uh, it. I'm <laughs> just... Hmm. Shit! <laughs> Can't open it. I'll be back. But know what you can open? Their hearts. A can of worms. True. I can always open up a can of worms. Is that it? Oh, that is. Okay, so I need to go that way then. Yo, cleaning Boy, droid, you want to see something cool? Want to see something cool? Oh, dude, there's another one that came to watch. Put that away, citizen. <sighs> Don't tell me what to do. Well, there's another cleaning droid that I could show just, my cool, cool just skills to. Just it. Just break all <laughs> <your insurance. laughs> Swoop restoration. Guys, you don't even understand. I was like the best. Kipuna na bonsha. Kava dumpa kupali. Wait, that's not that's not what's her face, right? No, I only. Okay, I cool. I dead. just wanted to make sure. No, 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 the one with the mission. Uh, no, I don't think so. I swear she was wearing the same thing. Kipuna na bonsha. She probably was probably the same model. Kava yeah. dumpa kupali yaya mokarpata. She would have had trouble with the to say that. Oh, dude, I'm totally gonna be 
Yeah. I want a season opener. Okay, I'll prove my skills here. Sure. Oh. No, that's fine. I'll support a small business. I don't know if this is a small business. It's just like Walmart for soup races. <laughs> oh, I can't remember. Uh, I just gotta hit all the pads and not hit the obstacles. Uh oh. Man, we just lost four seconds, Johnny. See, this is a cool. Ah! A cool map, though, because it has. Uh, right, that's what water. it is. Now I remember. It's only left and right, and then I space to, yeah. like, go faster. Aw. Or to shift. Now this is swoop racing. Part two. Should have been the fucking title. We did get off. Let's, let's get off this rock. Part three. Swoop race part two. Yeah, I know I did bad, okay, guys? God. I forgot how to swoop race, okay? It's been like a week. It's been like two months. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, I'm ready to do this again. Oof. All right, here we go. This one for sure. I got this one. I'm making <clears> the <throat> YouTube title. Oh, come on. I wasn't even near it. Shit. That was only two seconds better. Watch make all the difference. I know, right? Yeah. Nope. Boo. Yeah, whatever. What a loser. Pose. I'm glad that I can't skip anything. this. It's great. I'm glad that I have to wait and listen to them all boo me know how more. much of a loser you are. All right. All right. All right. I can't. Let's persuade him. Nope. Okay. Do force persuade. <laughs> I don't need to pay. There this. we go. I've already paid. I've you. done it twice already. I just need to warm up. Let me just warm up. I can't warm up. God. All right. Here we go. Let's do it. It just seems counterintuitive to put all these obstacles on the map. I mean, That's I was, fine. like, four seconds faster than Oh, faster. way better. I just can't hit anything. I can't do that or yeah. else it just... Hey, now everybody likes me. Yep, I'm a winner. Man, she just bowed for you. Thanks. We forgot all already about the two One of the first round kids. are paid 500. It's enough to cover your expenses, but you'll have to keep racing and really make it pay. We'll record a future reference with... All right, let's do it then. I can't pay that much. All right, we'll do it. What she, what time you have to beat? Hmm? It said a time you had to beat. Oh, I don't know. Let's go! Woo. Shit. I couldn't do the next one. Yeah. Like, it didn't let me. Man, 
second Holy round shit. win is worth 2,000 credits to you. Many races bow out of this level. Nah, dude, let's keep going, bro. Or before you do, your next race will be against the leading time set by Hook to Jackson. Please try not to anger the Gamorian. You can prove troublesome. Jail swoop. Where is he? He will be in the racer's lounge room just to the east. Okay. Damn, dude. So he's in the racer's lounge to the east? Is that is that what that is? I think so. Oh yeah, look at that. Swoop racers only. Hi dude. Told you already, I I want you to remember you don't win the sec sector champion spot. If you do, there will be trouble. I will race and I will win. I don't want any trouble. Then you was smarter than you look. I like to when people are reasonable. So what, I just have to talk to you? That's it? Okay, Wait, cool. What's that control panel over there? Can you do anything with it? <sighs> Swoop records pan Oh god. Oh no. Oh, that sucks. Uh-oh. What? Hold on. I need to Oh yeah, good call. We haven't saved in forever. Oh no. Yeet number three. Oh no. We haven't saved in forever. Oh no. Well, everybody. <laughs> We're going to end the game it here. Just crashed. I didn't All think right. to save it. I didn't yeah, think to save I didn't, it. I didn't either. I think I think it did auto save at some point. I hope right? so. I hope so. We'll be picking it up right from there. <sighs> we'll catch up and we'll just do it from there. Damn Shit. it. So objection. Mad. <laughs> That'll be the next one. All right. Well, all right. thank you all for joining us. We'll just fix it for next time. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Bye.